Let me go away, I'll be back after the cutscene, and it's starting. Look at that, no options even, you don't get any options. So our father has gone on a homicidal killing spree or something, and we're going to this giant place to find out why. Los Angeles, Los Angeles. I'm gonna up the brightness in a minute. I think it's a bit dark for you guys. <laughs> She's got fabulous hair. Oh my god, there's bodies everywhere! Oh, the humanity! Why would my father do this? My weave is fabulous today, though. Fuck, no food or beverages! No! Okay, I, I, it's way too dark for you guys. You can't see shit, so <laughs> I'm going to up the brightness quite a bit. So let me get... Okay, brightness. Contrast. Is that too bright? Just... Is that too bright? Or is that fine? Okay. Alright, so I'm going to... Uh Restart so you guys can see that again. We'll turn the webcam on right after the opening cutscene. I don't, I don't even know what this game, how this game works exactly, but yeah. I know <laughs> we're playing. PS1 game on the uh, PS3. I'm doing it again, so for the YouTube, because I'm, I'm gonna upload this to YouTube that way. It doesn't show me adjusting the brightness. That's why I'm starting from the beginning. Thank you for bearing with me. I love you, and I want your babies.
contrast is low, the brightness is high. just happened I what is going on oh my god what it the controls I know this game is super dark so it's a first person exploration game I know, that is so slow. Uh, look, there are no menus in this game. There's no menus. Move slow. I got this on eBay for about 20-some 20, 20 bucks. Yeah, it's a little bright, a little dark on your end, so let me dump it a little more. Is that better? Laura. 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 What? This is your father. Laura, go back. You must not cross over to this side. This is another world born of my own mind. Laura, go back. Come further and your world will be closed off from you. Laura, I'm... I am so turned on right now. Oh, God. <sighs> Laura, I am your father. This is going to be weird, this game. Can I go through there? So it's first person exploration. Oh, you twist that, baby. You twist it. Can you guys see? Can you make out details like the door handles and stuff? She has fabulous hair.
Okay, so you should be able to see a little bit. A little bit. <laughs> so all I can do is move forward and back. I can't, uh, I can't open any menus. I have no items yet. All I can do is move. Yeah, a lot of these older games, especially the rare ones, are expensive. I was trying to get this game called Rule of Rose, but my god, it's like 75 bucks for the cheapest one. It is. So all I can all I can do is right now is control with the the directional pad. Is that wine? The other one I was trying to get was uh, the uh, Fatal Frame 4 for the Wii, and that's like a hundred bucks to import it. What is... Okay. None of these buttons... Wait, what's she doing? There's got to be instructions in here as <laughs> to what the controls do. Man, look at this old school uh, insert. This thing's huge. Getting. Okay. Okay, so move forward. The circle button is touch, open, take, or move items. So circle. Display items is the top button. After the open induction tile screen appears, you can press start. Time limit. Due to its story, the game has a two hour time limit. Lower the protagonist into the hospital at 3 o'clock, but at 5 o'clock the other row is closed off. There's a two hour time limit? Oh shit. Are you serious? And it can't... Yeah, this game is a... You have to beat the game in two hours. You can't save. Wow. That's some intense shit. And there's multiple endings for the game. <laughs> what the fuck? Aww. Uh. Just stands there. It's like, take me, take me. Man, what's wrong with her? No spike trap. Better not. No, I can't do that. I don't want to get thrusted spikes on me. That would be bad. So I have. <laughs> I have my makeup kit. What? The power of Cover Girl. What is that? She's got a magic makeup mirror. <laughs> Was it breaks? Man, what is that? Girl, you are sexy. That's when I be turning the fuck around and running out the door. But no, we'll go further in. Graphics are just 
I felt like I was there. These graphics are intense. Can I go in here? Humanity! Oh my god! It's horrible! It's horrible! No! That's one fucked up closet, I'll tell you. <laughs> Come on. Uh. Let's turn. Let's go this way. <laughs> is in this room. Okay, let's... The mirror showed this thing right here, so let's see what's in here. One, two, three... One, two, three, I see numbers. Is that a magic cockroach? I don't... Nothing? I don't know what that was, or what that was supposed to be, or... I feel like I'm tripping on acid or something. Or something. Okay. Pull out number four here. Nothing. Whoops, I right, no go back, go back. Okay, try the last drawer. See if there's anything down there. Come on, panties. Give me some panties. Nothing. Apparently this is a drawer simulator. <laughs> Try opening the first door again. There's something there now. What does it say? What? Okay. Use it? Oh, is it blank? Must be... Must be blank, I guess. I don't... I guess we gotta find a way to see what's on there, I guess. Let's take a step back. I don't want to use the compact case, because I noticed that every time you use it, it cracks. So it probably, like, if you... The more you use it the more it's going to crack. Why <laughs> should get in a toilet seat? That's actually a little makeup thing. Can she not go over to the left there? To those drawers? Yeah, let's go in the fireplace. That seems like a great idea. Upskirt. She's not wearing any panties. She's 
a naughty girl. Nothing. Okay, let's back up. <laughs> You're welcome, Mount Lover. I like to play weird older games like this. Sometimes they're just like, you don't know what's happening. You're just like, what is going on? Look at those tits. Oh my god, they're getting bigger. They're getting bigger. Use them. That's a good close up there. Okay, let's go. There was a locked door downstairs. I don't know if that would be where this goes. It's it's odd seeing seeing a uh, seeing a first person perspective game on the PS1. That's not it's pretty uncommon. She loves to walk real slow, really slow. Let's go forward. Go. Walk. Walk. Well, wow. the sequel double D made this good. I hear the sequel to this is on the Dreamcast, actually. It's called D something. Yeah, this this game does have good atmosphere. It's true. Definitely makes you feel immersed. You feel like you're walking around. A really polygony, pixelated uh, thing of doom. Okay, can I use the key? Bring. Is she actually gonna pull the key out, put it in there? Ah, so immersive. Out of the humanity. What is in there? Is his arm stuck in the wall? Her father is in here and we're trying to get to our daddy. Figure out why why he killed everyone in the hospital. Hmm. Hey, I'm sure that I'm sure the description would be this game has visceral walking. Just crisp graphics. Crisp pixelated graphics. Am I supposed to use something there? something but nothing's available I don't know for a PS1 game they're actually this um, the graphics are pretty pretty good especially for being 3d like this let's turn let's try going through the big double doors maybe I have a piece of paper and I, that I can't seem to read. But yeah. Can I go through this door? Seems like there's something behind it, maybe. Nope. Ah, oh, come on. Well, if I can't go there. Okay, we're gonna have to resort to the handy dandy uh compact mirror. Our magic mirror of guidance. Oh, cover girl. What was that? This game, it's really slow. 
There's no saving, no pausing in this game. I don't know what that was. <laughs> I know my face is so ugly, it broke the mirror. Look at it, it's like, ew. Ew. Come on. Yeah, this game has a two hour time limit. And you can't save and you can't pause the game. The time is always ticking. It's kind of crazy. There's nothing I can do here. The mirror doesn't save, it just gives you guidance as to where to go. Maybe I'm supposed to use an item? Yeah, I don't think we're gonna get through the game. This could be one of those games where like you gotta constantly like fail and fail and get further and further and further. I gotta use the paper or something, I don't know why. Okay, let's go back. Turn around. Uh we we switched games because the the thing was really bad. The game was really just Brutal difficulty. It wasn't all that great in it either. Okay, let's go. Let's go try the hallway of death again. Or walking, walking. Yeah, if you if you can't continue the game, you're kind of screwed. Like if you have to just stop or take a break, it, the time constantly ticks. Maybe I can maybe I can use the letter with the the with this thing maybe. So maybe I'll be able to uh, wet it and it'll like show up maybe. Trying to make sense. Okay, that doesn't work. Yeah, the game is just called D. That's the that's the let. See, D. And that's all it's called. Well, let's uh. 